Thanks for tuning in, my name is True Swolger, and today I'm going to be showing you a very simple but funny glitch that will allow you to have the abilities of the ballistic equipment while still wearing your street clothes. When I first read about this, I didn't think it was all that great, but after playing around with it for a while, it's actually really fun and even funnier to think about from the perspective of your opponent. Because you can attack other players and all they will see is a normal character. They'll think, hey, I got this, and they'll fight back. They'll continue firing round after round as you just keep on killing them over and over. They'll keep coming back again and again, frustrated as ever, wondering why in the hell you won't die. You can even survive several explosions, making it that much more ridiculous and confusing your enemies even more. All you have to do is make sure you own the ballistic gear, which can be acquired through bunker research and then purchased from the Warstock Cash and Carry website. Register as a CEO or MC President. Then under Management, change the style by selecting any outfit. Then, call in your ballistic gear located under the Inventory category of your Interaction menu. Once it arrives, put it on. Now all you have to do is retire as a CEO or MC President, and you will now be wearing your normal clothes while still possessing the power of the Juggernaut, including infinite ammo, super max health, and being able to withstand more explosive damage. Even though it shows you in normal clothes, the game still treats you like you are wearing ballistic gear. So be sure to do the glitch wherever you plan on using it, preferably in a crowded area for maximum trolling. Otherwise, you're going to have a long jog ahead of you because you can't get into any vehicle unless you have a friend to haul you around in a Vapid Guardian or Wastelander. I suggest picking up some snacks before doing the glitch in order to regenerate health and keep it going even longer. Shout out to Reaction Mods and his crew for stumbling across this. I'll put a link to the Seven Sins article along with their channel down in the description. With all that being said, I want to thank everybody for watching. Be sure to click subscribe to stay up to date with all my gaming content. Hit that like button if you feel it in your hearts to do so. And last but not least, stay swole.